What's up, guys? So we had uh, we have news from Mamlodi Sanon's camp. Yes, Clorco. They have signed a defender. They have signed a centre back, and he goes by the name of Brian Onyango, who we last know to play for Mauritsburg United. But now he goes to Mamlodi Sanon's. And I gotta tell you, man, um, interesting signing. Interesting because for me, point the point one would be: Do I feel Mamlodi Sanon's needed him? I think the answer is no. I, I don't think they needed him. That's what I think. But another thing is, point number two could be, now that Bamaluti Sanos have signed him, I think this sort of confirms that there are players that are leaving Bamaluti Sanos or could be leaving Bamaluti Sanos. The like of Wayne Aronson has been linked to be leaving the club. The likes of uh, Somahuru has been linked to leave the club. So if they're going to be going, he's definitely going to be slotting in for sure and helping them out. I think maybe the positive I will say about Brandon Young is that he's obviously big. He's physical. Um, he's got the attributes that you would need from a, a strong center back. And also the fact that he's also got time on his side. He's only 26 years old. So that's a good part about Mumbai Sanons. Also considering the fact that the likes of Nascimento uh in the 30s mid 30s or something like that close to mid 30s and all that stuff so the fact that he's gonna come in and also help out in terms of having to be there for a while i don't think he slots straight into the starting 11 he's definitely gonna have to compete for that at mom lutis and not they won competition and that's the that's the case so that's the one thing that that's how i see it i don't think they needed him i don't think so but because they signed him, I just think it confirms that there's going to be some, some, some players that are going to be leaving the club. But all the best to him, of course.